My name's Andrew Clark. I'm the proprietor chef of St. Leonard's restaurant in Shoreditch. This is a live fire restaurant where we have got some big joints of meat and fish, vegetables all cooking over a three meter medieval half, and a raw bar where we do lots of kind of sashimis and crudos, shellfish, oysters. My inspiration is uh, an amalgamation of kind of places I've worked, chefs and cookbooks and restaurants I've eaten in that inspire me to kind of push myself in a direction that eventually I'm cooking food that I really want to be eating myself. There's been a lot of chefs I've worked for over the years that stood the test of time. I think Fergus Henderson has always been a, an inspiration for me in terms of what he's done with food but also how amazing his restaurants have been and what an eye-open experience it was from I think the first time I went in there when I was 20 years old. Our innovation I think comes from the fact that we're just getting back to basics. You know we try and cook everything around the fire and there has to be some relevance around the kitchen that all food goes back to that half. So whether we're prepping vegetables to be put on a cold dish later on on the raw bar. There's a lot of other kind of modern equipment in the kitchen so it's having a nice balance between something that's so primal, medieval, old and then having a few modern things. So it's being able to blend those two together. From a personal point of view, um, I shared a story on Instagram um, where I talked about my experiences and I didn't think anything of it when I spoke about it the first time. But there were so many people that came back to me saying, you're saying something we can't say. That was such an important thing that I felt if my voice is quite loud and you know, I'm a big guy and I don't really, you know, I'm not scared of anyone. <laughs> Pilot Light is a campaign that's devoted to speaking out about mental health issues particularly for chefs and hospitality. A secret? Well, I, I don't think I have too many secrets because I'm quite open and I, I probably give too much away, certainly in the kitchen. And anything else should be, remain a secret, I think. <laughs> My success so far has come from the ingredients that I use, the suppliers that I work with. I couldn't do this job without them. We like that food journey. Everything has been well considered and well sourced. We've always been keen to forage and we, we do that a lot ourselves. We also use as much waste produce, so, you know, giving something a second life. I'd be over the moon to win this award. I mean, you know, it, it, it just feels like then all the hard work's paid off. And, you know, it has been a lot of hard work. So to be even nominated is a, a great thing, but to win it would be really, really special. If I win tonight, I'll shave my beard off. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs>